So welcome to Life in Balance. Today we have Dr. John Thomas from uh, Vibrant Life Health Center. He's going to tell us all about, you know, chiropractic and how, how it can help you and their new program called Life in Balance, Yes, right? yes, exactly. You know, it's exciting. The program is, is, a lot of people ask, why Life in Balance? Why now? Okay. What do we want to do this for? And there's no better time if we take a look at the state of our health today. If we look at just the obesity rates and, okay. and the investment that people are making in relationship to that, if we take a look at the uh, costs that fam families are putting out for health care, uh, for insurance, well, for medication. The reality is the health care system is broken. It I is mean, broken. I don't care what anybody says, yeah. it's broken. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It's you broken. pay out godly amounts of money for health insurance, and the reality is when you go to the doctor, most of the times they say, oh, that's not covered. Exactly. So you're paying more and more and getting less and less. And that's really why we brought Life and Balance into play, is because we really need to have answers. We need to have solutions. We have to have services and opportunities for you to really have uh, steps to your health that pr produce results and resolve your problems. I always think about it from this perspective. If health is a proactive thing, if you're not actively trying to take care of your health, then you're going to get the opposite of that. I mean, when you see people obese and all that, a lot of it is, some of them, they're just making bad choices. Yes, yeah, they're making bad and, choices. and that's really what it's about because when you take a look at what's happening, uh, I always like to use the, uh, the metaphor, so to speak, or the imagery that you know many people drive a car and they're looking in their rearview mirror and they're doing that with their right, health right. and then they swerve once they hit something. Right. Now how good is that going to do for you, right? But that's how we're doing our health care today. That's it. I mean, you go to the doctor when you're sick instead of trying to make sure you don't get sick. And one of the things that transformed my life about 20 years ago actually is I met a chiropractor and he put me on the path of not paying attention to the doctors because they really they want you in there when you are sick and I don't really want to get sick right and I happen to own my own business and the reality is I can't be sick because if I'm out things don't get done that's so, right so I, I just started doing things to take care of myself and that's kept me on that path for a pretty long time but even when you're doing when you think you're doing things right a lot of times you really need a good professional like you to help you understand what's true and what's fake and all the other kind of stuff that's out there. Exactly, and that's what Life and Balance is all about. To go through your specific issues and then also go through your specific body. What's going on in your metabolism? What's going on with your structure? What's going on with detoxification? You know, what are you doing with your fitness situation? You know, what are you doing for movement? How are you making sure that every component that you need to do in a health plan yes. is going to get its maximum output. Yeah. And that that's what this Life and Balance program is you're talking about. I mean, you've been doing chiropractic for a pretty long time. Oh, yeah. Like what? 17, 18, 17 18 years. 17, years, yeah. 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 And again, today what we really need is more of a comprehensive approach, and that's exactly what you've put together in this program. I mean, I, when I go to your office, I see lives transformed. I often hear you say that's a blessing that you see all these lives transformed in your life. Tell us a little bit about that. You know, it's really, it's a great thing. I mean, we've, we've, we've got so many great stories. We have so many people that come to us, and they've done everything. You know, they come to us and they say, I've tried everything, it doesn't work. Or, you know, I've, I've, I've been on this, and I'm just not getting the, the results that I have. Or, you know, I've tried the medication, I've tried the pain medication, the muscle relaxers, and the right. anti-inflammatories, and my back is still killing me. Or my neck is still hurting. Yeah. And it's just... Or it worked for a few days, and now it's back. And now it's back, exactly. <laughs> and that's really what we talked about with the sickness model, is that when you, they want you to keep coming back. Right. You know, and so you're going to still have the problems that you've had when you started. It's not a, it's disease management, which means we're going to manage the problem rather right. than eliminate it. Right. That's the key. Right. And, you know, when we talk about the blessings that we have here, people who are restoring their health. I have a patient that he lost, uh, you know, on our weight loss program, he lost 40 or 50, you know, 53 pounds in the first 40 days. He went on past it, didn't do another round with us, but just took everything that we taught him, and he lost another 52 pounds. Wow. And so... I mean, we're talking 100 and some pounds that this man that lost. And major transformation in his life. It's, it's a, you know, he's a truck driver, and so now he's getting in on a truck, he's moving the, the materials better, he's just living a life that's actually more uh, fitting to have longevity in what he's doing. And a happier life, I can tell you that. I mean, having been through your program, which is pretty cool, um, and I can talk firsthand, losing 30 pounds to some people doesn't sound like a lot, but when you're not a big person, I mean, I'm only 5'7", 30 pounds is a lot, and it major transformation I mean I do a lot of walking I've been doing a lot of walking for a long time and and if your feet hurt walking is a problem it is and it, it was is. Getting to the point where my left foot just wouldn't heal I mean it just hurt all the time so I just kept walking anyway I was walking like five miles a day when I lost the weight 
that pain went away. Amen. It and was that's like what it's a about. miracle. <laughs> yes, so that's what it's about. It's about releasing you into that so that right. you're going to get the best out of it, you know, and that's that's what it's all about yeah. for sure. Um, tell us a little bit about some of your patients who've had serious weight problems. I know you just talked about, um, mm -hmm. what was it, Carlos, I think it was, but tell us about some of these other people because I've one of the things that made me do the weight loss program is I'd be there for chiropractic treatment, and I'd see all these people come in and out, and they're all real happy, and lots of them had lost a lot of pounds. I mean, I, they have. I, when you go in the office, it's sort of neat. You see testimonials <laughs> pasted all over the wall. There's like 300 of them, okay? Yeah, totally. And you can't help but read them. And when you see someone a night and day, like when somebody loses 50 pounds, it looks, they look like a different person. And when I look at my picture from 204, 8 to 171, I look totally different. As a matter of fact, I was meeting with a with our, one of our accountant friends, and he says, I remember you looking like that. Because <laughs> I was showing in the picture. And again, I mean, I'm holding my pants up like that, and it's, you know, yeah, it's just it's, an amazing thing. It is amazing. And, you know, those transformations, they're very powerful because not only are you losing the fat, not only are you changing your appearance, how your body functions, how it heals, what it's doing, it's all about the metabolism. Yeah. That's what the weight loss component is. And so we get the metabolism restored so that your body is going to be in a better sense of balance. And so it's doing everything at its best. You know, younger meta metabolic ages, younger, you know, lighter weight, all those types of things, bringing water into cells, it's, it's huge. Yeah. I know in future programs we'll talk in detail about, you know, Nutramos and how it works and all those kinds of things. Yeah. But it's really a really cool thing on how how different it is from so many of these other programs, especially the ones you see on TV, because all the TV shows, they mm -hmm. always have, you know, Nutra, whoever. Yeah, <laughs> totally. Uh, but your program is extremely different, and the results are usually two to three times as fast. Yes, exactly, and that's really unique. And, you know, that's, that's kind of where we get back to, you know, the life and balance, and talking about that is when we get to somebody to that point, what's the next step? And that's why we, another reason we created Life and Balance is to take you to the next step right. because you're someone that does a lot of things to really incorporate preventative health. You're doing a lot of things and researching what, you know, what are the best right. things I could be. And one of the big questions is people take supplements out there right. and they start talking about, you know, is, should I be on this supplement? You know, if it says this or that, and maybe I should take it for this. And how do they know that they, they exactly. should be taking it? They, if you go to your doctor and ask them that, they say, well, that does, stuff doesn't do anything. I mean, I've heard that so many <laughs> times from doctors. That doesn't do anything. You shouldn't be taking that. Vitamins don't do anything. I mean, I hear that over and over again. And then I read, you know, study after study after study. And then the question is, it maybe does that, but do you need it? Right, exactly. <laughs> and that's where we do the micro-macronutrient testing. When we go into the blood testing, we evaluate and specifically what are your true deficiencies. You can so even do genetic guessing. testing. And stuff genetic, like that. telomere testing. We do all types of, you know, hormone testing. All those things can be evaluated. So we can tell specifically what is your body's issues and develop a plan and a roadmap so that we know where we're going. And what's amazing to me is regular doctors have had access to this stuff for forever, but they never order it. They no. never order it. No. It's like we don't care about that stuff. I mean, maybe I'm being mean, but I don't. <laughs> well, <laughs> you know, the, the, the issue is that it's just a little bit of a different paradigm. They have a protocol Sickness that they're brilliant. following, and they're following right. that, and their, their idea is they want to get the symptoms off of you. Yeah. you know, they want to make sure you're not suffering. And absolutely, well, we want to take it to the next step. We want to remove the suffering, but we want to do it in a way that we're actually addressing the first reason why right. you had the suffering. Right. You know, it's kind of like the Band-Aid and suture kind of thing. It's like people with back pain. There's, there's very simple things in many cases that they can do. Weight loss would be one of them. It's like an oh, immediate... Yeah. I mean, oh, yeah, way it's a major, major change. <laughs> <laughs> but, I, I, for example, walking. I read in one of your articles on, on a Vibrant Life uh, the blog, it says just walking can yes. reduce back pain tremendously. And it can. For me, I do a lot of walking. That's why I don't have a lot of back exactly. pain. Exactly. Can you imagine <laughs> what would happen if you didn't do all that walking? Yeah. You know? <laughs> I'd be visiting you twice as much. That's <laughs> right. Maybe you need to stop walking. No. <laughs> but, you know, when we take a look at that, it, it's about knowing exactly what's right for you. What are the right things for you to take? What are the right fitness steps for you to take? Because obviously, if somebody's not going to say you need to be running a marathon every other day, that'd be kind of crazy. But what is the right type of movement for you? Because for some people, just getting out and walking a mile right. is a major milestone for right. them to get to. And when they got to that, their bodies would be so much better for what they're doing. Yeah. Where there's other people that have different capabilities. Or it's even drinking water. I mean, I've never seen so amazed me how many people, they just don't hydrate. Right. And then they wonder why their body doesn't work right. Now, in the summertime, they're thinking about it because it's really hot and all that. But 
You gotta hydrate in the winter time too. I mean, uh, absolutely. Really <laughs> and that's another reason why you have back pain, just yeah. from dehydration, right. straight in the muscle structure. Right. And so you have those issues, and you've got to make sure that's that's part of your program. Yeah. And that's one of the things that I've, I've really always noticed. And this is chiropractic in general, but your office in particular, in that comprehensive overview and understanding of the patient is a big deal in your office. Yes. So when I came in, I had to fill out this four or five page thing, and. That's really good because the more you understand where I'm coming from and where I've been, the better you can offer effective treatments that right. help me. Exactly. And a lot of people don't do that. Most chiropractors do a pretty good job of that. Mm-hmm. Regular doctors, I don't remember. I mean, they some of them might do a family history. Right. But for the most part, they don't really do a lot of that stuff unless they're a holistic MD or something right. like that. And, you know, that's interesting because I, I had a patient actually the other day that asked me about those types of things. And I said, you know, this allows us to bring treatment for you specifically. So I'm not making you fit my treatment techniques, but I'm actually making my treatment techniques fit what you need. And that's a big difference in a paradigm because a lot of doctors will get out there and they have these tools in their toolbox and they just apply it to everything that comes along in the door. The the difference between the carpenter and the bricklayer. Exactly, bingo right there. You know, we've got to make sure that the things that we're doing have a direction, have a goal, and that's what life and balance is about, is to really evaluate you as a whole. What are the micro and macro nutrients you need? What is, you know, do you need weight loss? Do we need to do that? Can you give us, I was going to say, give us a little bit of a, I mean, because there's like five or six different areas that this new program you're doing covers. So give us a little overview of the different areas if you can. Absolutely. Well, the first one we talk about is the structural correction. Looking at the structure of your body, the chiropractic end of it, to make sure because you don't build a house on a broken foundation. Right. It's just not a good idea. That's the foundation of your body. And we've got to make sure that that is optimized. Once we get that evaluated, then we'll move into things like uh, micro and macronutrient testing, which we've already talked about. Making sure that the physiology of your body, what are the true vitamin and mineral deficiencies? What are the metals? If they're hormone issues, right. what are the genetic predispos- predispositions that you might have? So we understand all that componentry too. Then there's another step that is probably one of the most ignored steps in all of what we do, and that is called detoxification. There's a lot of people that will do this detox or this detox, but a lot of them really aren't that effective. So we've got to go back and look, and that's one of the great things about Life and Balance is we've gone and evaluated what are the true detoxification programs out there that have been used for years and years and years and have seen researched effectiveness and so we've incorporated those into it so we can identify specifically the organ we're going to do the kidneys we're going to do the intestinal tract we're going to do the gallbladder we're going to do the liver and we're going to take it in stages and figure out exactly what you need first and then go through that whole process of detoxifying the body because once you go through a program you detoxify it's great but then if it goes into the liver and the lymphatics you're still carrying all the problems we've got to get it out of the body And so that's another big component of this. Then we go into the fitness aspect. What is the right fitness for you, as we talked about before? You know, what is the right milestones to set for you? And what is is within your capability? And so we've got to make sure that those are going to be the right setups as well for you to go through the process. Um, You know, and then as we go through, we do food management. What are the right foods for you to eat? We take a look at that. What are, you know. Portion sizes, all those kinds of things. Exactly. You know, what is the coherence? We actually use a biofeedback tool to understand specifically how your cellular structure responds to the foods you're eating. So we know exactly the layout of the plan of what you can eat with no doubt. That's why the, the Nutramos program is really so effective because it looks at what foods work best for you. It's yes. sort of cool. And now, now that's being incorporated in the life and balance. Right. Program. So we're pulling that right in as well. And so you're going to have that component in it as well. And then the other most important and critical component of this life and balance program is the support that you get through the process. And that's one of the things that we've always talked about with the other programs that we do is that we're there all along the way. And I always call it health mentoring rather than health coaching because a coach looks for the or- or organizational right. boundaries. You know, we're trying to make the organization better with a coach. You know, if he has a football team, it's not about the players, it's about the stands, getting the fans in there right. and making sure that we're winning the football games. Where when we get into being a mentor, a mentor looks at the individual and says, right. how can I make that individual the best that they can be? And that's what we're going to go after. So you're going to have that throughout the whole process. And I know that when I went through the, the Nutramost program, uh, that was really one of the best parts because, I mean, if I had a question, I'd just text you. I'd get an answer back pretty quickly. Yep. Uh, it was really great for my wife also because when she was at the beginning, she had really low energy. She said, I'm really, really tired. One phone call 
solved that problem. I mean, you, you just changed their supplements a little bit. Yep. And it was like throwing a switch. I mean, it was pretty magical Boom, stuff. Just Boom. like that. Yeah. And that's, that's, that's that support. It's key to have that type of support so that you are getting uh, – a plan and, a, and and resolution to your specific issues rather than saying, I'll oh, just wait a couple weeks, it might turn around. That's not a good answer. I know we're about halfway into the show. Um, mm -hmm. We want to incorporate some cool things in the show, and this is a new show, so it's going to be evolving. Oh, yeah. But we want to probably come up with a tip of the week. So a Tip of the week. What's your tip of the week? You know, the tip of the week, right now, we talked about hydration. It's in the heat of the summer right now. We're coming into the beginning of August. It's degree days. Yeah, actually. and the heat index is almost 110 on some right. of these days. Right. It's crazy. Um, and when we take a look at that, people say, well, I'll just I'll drink Papel or I'll drink you know sodas or I'll drink those things. You've got to think, drink things that add to you. One of the best things you can do is, is start your day with actually just starting with lemon water. Right. Getting a glass of water, adding half a lemon to it, and, and drinking that about a half an hour before you eat anything. And what that does is it starts to begin the cellular hydration process in the body. And you said something about that the lemon juice actually helps your body absorb it or something. It does. And actually, there's a concept called osmolality. And it's a pressure gradient. It's a pressure difference between the cell and the water that's around the cell. And the lemon water shifts that so enough to where the cell will suck the water in. Okay. There's, because it's a pressure change. Okay. And so the lemon can help you get water into your cells. And that's really where it matters. You know, a lot of people, they drink a lot of water and it just goes through them and they're visiting right. the bathroom all the time. That's a red flag because that means your cells aren't getting the right. water and it's not going to hydrate you. You're going to actually be further dehydrated. So doing these and, and kinds yeah, of things. And, and again, a lot of people say, okay, I need to be hydrated. So they're going to drink a Coke or a Pepsi or, or coffee yeah. and not, not realizing that most of those things actually push the water out. out. Yes, yeah. they do. And they pull minerals with them and then you've got some deficiencies and, and you're, you're draining your body. You right. see your, your, all the things you're doing in life to make yourself tired and then you're drinking some things that even make it worse. So that lemon water really gets it. Then the other thing that it does is it helps to start digestion too. It gets digestion rolling in the morning so that you're going to be actually more active so when you eat, your body's ready to take yeah. it. And so there's a lot of benefits to doing those types of things. So I know we're going to be talking about these tips, and oh, they, yeah. they have tons of tips. If you've ever read a blog that's got so much useful information, it's not even funny. Um, if you want to get more of the tips, you can go to their blog. Uh, it's Creating a Vibrant Life. It's on blogspot.com. It's blogger. It's a blogger blog. It's, if you can't find it, just give me a call. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. If you just do a search uh, for that, you'll you'll find it pretty easily. It's going to be up there. And they've got, I don't know, 100, and, not 100, but I think 60 articles in there that cover a whole bunch of things. Oh, absolutely. And there, it's a new one every week, too. Yeah. So oh, yeah, just definitely. Like it's a one-time thing. Um, tell us something that's a little bit misunderstood of, of the health concepts that you're, you're talking about. You know, the misunderstanding is a lot of things that we talk about is, is one of the big things is I do all these things and I should get health. You know, um, I'm going to take these vitamins and, and it's the marketing says on the box that I can get it. So I should be able to solve all my problems with doing that. And then people get more and more frustrated and they start leading themselves down that, that what I call a galloping lane of, right. of self Doctor, self, treat yourself yeah, type of you know, thing. Yeah. You know, self-medication, so to speak. Yeah. And you get that. And that's really misunderstood because there is a lot of information out there. There's a ton. And, and here's from my own personal experience. You could be doing a lot of things right, but if you're doing one or two things wrong, it actually counteracts yes. the things that you're doing right. So I was walking five miles a day. I was taking supplements that I'm pretty sure are meant for me. And actually, when we did the testing, I was pretty much right on. Yep. But I still wasn't losing the weight. And I wasn't eating big meals. I was actually counting calories and everything. But I was stuck, and it wasn't going anywhere. Right. And by understanding some different things that I didn't know, changed all that. Changed it. And that's what people need to understand, that there's, they think that this stuff is simple. Right. And the reality is, if it was simple, everybody would be skinny and, and, and healthy. rich. Exactly, <laughs> right? <laughs> you know, that's what it would be. Yeah. And it, because and I, it's, I tell a lot of my patients, if this was easy, it wouldn't be a problem. Yeah. And that's and it is a big problem in our country, and it's, it's not easy. So you've got to have the right steps. And that's what's yeah. really misunderstood is people, you know, the other thing that's really misunderstood is people don't value the health as much as they should. And right, that's right, really yeah. a big misunderstanding because it's the most important asset you have. Yeah, if you're not healthy, you can't do anything. If yeah. I mean, I, I like the outdoors. So I'm a, I've been a, a active scouter, which is a Boy Scout leader, uh, for going on 14 years. And I mean, I'm not the kind of person who will go to the beach and lay down and get a suntan. I mean, that's the last thing I want. I want to go to the beach and go jump on the water or go get in a kayak or whatever. Go windsurfing. I mean, I'm, I'm a very active person. And you can't do any of that stuff if you're not feeling well. Right. You can't do good work for people if you're not feeling well. You can't do 
pretty much any. You can't sit in front of the TV if you're not feeling. Well. That's right. I mean, there's a lot. Of, exactly. You know, you're not going to do the best that you can be, and you know that takes a little bit of investment in you too. And it should be the the most you invested, okay. in my opinion. I mean, that should be the thing. There should be no question. Yeah. And uh, there's a lot of people that won't take that step. You know, they yeah, think uh, for, insurance for, for is going to For me, take it, yeah. For me, it. think about this: when people go to the grocery store, they'll buy the cheapest food. Right. In most cases. And they don't understand what they're, they're really shortchanging their health when they're buying that box off the shelf or whatever instead of buying the vegetables. And even when if they're buying the good foods like vegetables and, and, and lean meats and so on, in many cases they won't buy the organic stuff because it's twice as much. Right. But again, that investment in the better stuff is an investment in your health and they don't really get that they don't, they don't. They don't. They don't relate it that way. And yeah. it, it pays dividends in the long term because you're going to save from doing the medications and the vitamins and all the other things because yeah. you're getting it And here's food. one of the things that's really nice about your, your program that, that you help people put that together. Yes. And this new life and balance program, that's one of the, that's one of the elements because yes. that's where people really go. They don't have a, a road map. Right. You give them a road map, they got a chance. They do. I mean, exactly. if they put the map down, sorry, you know, you're going to get lost. <laughs> but if they have a road map, they have a really good chance of making exactly. it. Exactly. I mean, and that's really what it's about. And this this program even goes as far as to say, okay, you're going to take these supplements and you're going to take them for this long of a period of time. Then you're going to take a break. And we're going to, in that break, we're going to detoxify this organ. And these are the steps to do that. Then you're going to start up on the supplement program we have for you. And it's going to walk you through that road map, you know, just like. You know those GPSs, take a left here, take a right here. That's what you're going to have in this program. And that is another really big step that's missed in all these programs is they give you, well, here's your supplements, and uh, right. here's a page to tell you how to detoxify, and, and there you go. Right. And then it's left to you to go figure out, well, the bottle says I take this much, and they didn't really say anything how to take it. And well, not only that, they'll, they'll often give you prescriptions, and they didn't check to see if you were taking other prescriptions. Exactly. And, and, and the same thing even with supplements. And on top of that, supplements are not equal by any stretch of the imagination. Oh, yeah. I mean, they're... They're, they're much less regulated than drugs, for that they matter. Are. So, yes, so the, they the are. So the quality is all over the place. I mean, for example, I remember when I first started learning about calcium, it was like 20 years ago, and you would read this as calcium carbonate and so on. And I started reading about it and it says, see, you eat that, it's like a rock. I mean, it's going to go right through. Your body will absorb like a teeny tiny amount. You have to have some kind of bioavailable yeah, calcium. exactly, you do. Yeah. The and, key and, is, you nailed it, right? right. Bioavailable. Bioavailable. So I started looking, well, how do I get bioavailable? Well, really, you need to eat these green leafy vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that's exactly. Not, that's the best way to get it. Now, that doesn't mean I don't take a calcium supplement, but if I buy one, I'm looking for one that's really bioavailable. It'll say it on the label. It will. It it's will. got some UL listed on there. I could do a little research on it. Yeah. Most people are just sort of lazy, I think. I mean, they need to, if they want to live a healthy life, the reality is the average person, in my opinion, could live to be about 120. Yes. Now, they could actually live a very vibrant life into their hundreds. Yes, exactly. If they took good care of this stuff that they were given. They do. They do. And they, and they you know, it's funny because, <laughs> and, it, and like we were talking about earlier, they'll go to the store and they'll see, well, this probiotic here, this is thirty nine ninety nine, right. And it's got, you know, sure, it's got 50 billion uh, right. cultures in it. It comes from 15 this different strands. This one's eight ninety nine. It's not in the refrigerator, so you know it's not even alive. Right. And, oh, well, this one's so cheap, but it's probiotic, so I'm going to take this one. Right. And then they're like, well, that doesn't work. Well, the, the, the you made a decision at the counter that it's not going to work, right? right? And, and that's what we really need to do is we really need to take people and show them. And educate them so that exactly. they understand what works and what doesn't work. And, and in the health field, making the right choices, I think, is going to be the biggest deal. And that's what this program, in my opinion, is really all about. If you help them make the right choices, they will improve their health and yes. they will be happy. And then they're going to bring more clients and all that other kind of stuff. I mean, in our in our world today, one of the biggest problems is health. Right. I mean, think about it. if you look at our just our economy. It's the biggest part of our entire economy. It is. It's crazy, and we're the richest nation in the world, and yet we're like fiftieth in health. Yeah. Or some it's, crazy. It's, I think we're forty third. I think <laughs> yeah. was the last last time they put that. Some crazy position. I mean, it's just like we have we spend more money in schools, and our schools suck. <laughs> and we spend ungodly amounts of money on health, and our health sucks. It's yeah. really great. I mean, I remember reading in one of your recent articles about the health statistics in Florida. Florida alone, yes. Yeah, it was like crazy. Like the obesity, the obesity rate in Florida was like through the roof. I'm like, it is. 
This is the Sunshine State. You're supposed to be wearing bikinis and going to the beach. Eh. Yeah, exactly, you know. And you look at that, and I think it, it, we'll talk about that on a gloss in another yeah. show. But, uh, you know, the, the amount of money that we're spending, and it's not, people see those numbers on a report, and they're like, oh, man, the state's spending that money. It's not the state, it's you. Right. You know, you're spending it in the prices at the grocery store. You're spending it in the prices of the gas. You're spending it in the prices of your own health insurance and the things that you're doing because that is a cost that's driven into everything that we do. And here, here's sort of a little hidden thing. This this has sort of evolved over time. I, I remember when I started, you know, thinking about healthy stuff. And when I was a kid, I mean, I liked Oreos and big oh, yeah. and a whole bunch of these other things. And now, when you go to buy Oreos, they're not the same Oreos that your grandma no, had. Okay? Not at all. They got all kinds <laughs> of other stuff in them. I mean, it used to be that it, it, they had natural ingredients for the yes. most part, mm -hmm. even in junk food. Yes. If you could call Oreos junk food. Uh, today... When you try and read it, you you got to have like an encyclopedia to try and figure out what the oh, hell yes. the words mean. I mean, they're big Greek letters and all this kind of stuff. And most people don't pay attention to that. They say, I've been drinking Coke all my life. Coke's formula has changed like nine times oh, in the yeah. last 20 years. Oh, yeah. It's not what it used to be. Most of the cookies and stuff are, they've got lots and lots and lots of preservatives in them. Now, the good thing is this is a trend. I mean, I just saw on the news yesterday, McDonald's is removing you know, artificial preservatives and stuff from their chicken McNuggets, which is one of their number one selling products. I mean, right. they're being shoved into all kinds of kids' throats. <laughs> exactly. And, and and they're saying, we're removing that. Not very long ago, one of the cheese companies, I forget what the name of the, the cheese macaroni stuff, they said, we're... We're putting in natural cheese now. Oh, yeah, exactly. Well, Chili's just about the, what the, the franchise Chili's, all the restaurants are going to grass-fed meats. You know, and that's really what it's about. It's right. about they're realizing that, you know, hey, we've got to we're, make sure we're that we're killing our ourselves with all the junk yeah. that we're putting in. And it's crazy. And that's what and we just don't know. And that's what Life and Balance is about is we're going to take you and guide you through the steps to make sure that you know that you know what you're doing. And, you know, the story you said about your wife is perfect. Yeah. You know, although she was taking all the right supplements that we had, even understanding how they work in her body and making a few tweaks we got to run it again. Big difference, it right? makes a big difference. It goes from actually attempting to make a health right. situation to actually accomplishing right. some results. And where else can we find programs like our micro and micronutrient testing where we're going to go back in, right. retest in the program, and make sure that we've done what we are set out to do? So we have yeah. checkpoints. Your, your practice is different from many other ones that I've looked at because most of them offer chiropractic, most of them offer some kinds of different kinds of adjustments. Most of them offer some kind of nutritional consultation or maybe exercise consultation, but you go a whole nother level. I mean, these other levels with the nutrient testing and all that kind of stuff, that really takes it to a, a big level. And you're not trying to look at it from, let's fix this, let's fix that. You're looking at the big picture and trying to help them with their overall health. Yes. And then that makes it actually easier to manage the, indi the individual exactly, thing. Exactly, because in the end, I mean, I had a patient that I talked to last night when I was in an event, and they came and asked me, they have a, an individual they want me to, t to take a look at. And it's been through, they've been through the hospital, they've been through all this testing, and every symptom that the person has, they're treating that with a specific, specific yeah. plan. And none of the doctors are really correlating what they're doing. And as she went through and described the individual to me, I said, the problem is, it's a digestive issue with that individual. Mm -hmm. And he's got Rosetta, you know, he's got joint pain, he's got, and that's, that's, that's all digestive issues. Mm -hmm. And it comes from, he's actually a Down syndrome uh, patient. And they've done so many things to this individual, detoxifying plans mm -hmm. and gluten-free and this, that his body is just toxified. And mm -hmm. I said, the first step we've got to do with him is detoxify that. Mm -hmm. Clean him out and then start restoring the systems that need to be restored yeah. they, they have to start from a baseline point i know we got only about a minute and a half left yep um i want to make sure that people understand where they can go to get a lot of this really good information they want to go to creating a vibrant life that's on blogspot.com yep um so it's creating a vibrant life dot blogspot.com is the easiest way to get to it that if you also do a search in blogger you'll find it mm -hmm. if you actually just do a search it'll come up too yeah I mean, if, oh yeah um also you can go to uh Vibrant Life Health Center. Yep. That's the dot com. That's the Vibrant Life Health Center dot com, and we also call it blhcjax.com right. right. to make it easier for you. If you want to type in a few letters? You want to give them the phone number? Yeah, absolutely. It's 904 683 8177. So you call us, and we'll just definitely right. get right back to you. Leave us a message if nobody answers because the phones get busy sometimes. But. Right. I, especially after any of the TV shows and stuff oh, like yeah. that. Oh, yeah. I know definitely. it's usually they, they get a bunch of calls. So um, I don't know what to tell you until the next show. 
That's right. I mean, the next show, we're going to do some fun stuff. We're going to be covering some great things about headaches. We're going to be talking about how to select your right chiropractor. We're going to be talking about uh, Nutrimost and weight loss itself. So we've got a lot of things coming that are going to be great shows in the lineup. Don't miss it. You're going to be really getting some great information. Yeah. So tune in for some more Life in Balance, folks. Till next time. Thank you.